Good morning and hello from home. I know it's been a while since I've last filmed this kind of video, at least here on this channel. At times I can be a bit indecisive. That's just how I am. I'm working on it, I promise. I think the main reason why I wanted to stop filming these kind of videos is because at certain moments it can be very overwhelming when you're constantly being judged by the internet especially when you're just living your own personal life which has led to me being not in a fun place to be in and over the last two years i have had a lot happen in my life a lot has changed in my life but i have learned a lot in the past two years which now leads me into wanting to make today's video because I'm so happy. For the first time in my life, nothing bad is happening. I'm enjoying every day. I'm waking up with a smile on my face every day. I can't complain about anything. And there's two reasons why I wanted to document today's video, which I'm filming right now. Number one, because for any of you watching right now, if you're going through anything, just know it will get better because it has gotten better for me. And I never thought this would happen, but it's happening right now and I'm so blessed. And the second reason is because when I look back on these videos, let's just say in 20 years, I want to remember the place that I'm in right now. So I'm using this video as just a chapter in my life that I really want to be remembered. And for content purposes, as a person who watches YouTube, and I also do YouTube as a viewer, there's a few creators where I really would like to see what they're like just in a normal setting on their normal day when they're not filming and working. Now, I'm not saying I'm going to be making these kind of videos often because I'm not, I promise, but every now and then when I feel like making one of these videos where I just want to show you guys what's happening in my life, that way I can look back and remember it because making these videos are pretty dang cool just as a person who can just go back and relive moments that have happened in my life. Anyway, today is Sunday, which I love Sundays because this is the day where I can just do whatever I feel like doing. If I feel like working today, I'll go work. If I feel like being lazy and binging a TV show, I'm going to do that. Or if I need to run any kind of errands or just any catching up that I need to do, like laundry, which I've already done my laundry, don't have to worry about that. Today would be the day. So I thought to myself, what the heck, let me bring you guys with me for whatever I do today, which is just the day that I can do absolutely anything that I want to do, which I'm very lucky to be able to have a day like this. It's going to be fun and who knows, maybe we'll relate to something. For those of you who are sticking around, I hope you guys are ready because I am. Let's go do this. All right, the first thing that I will do once I wake up, I always come downstairs, check on the fish, and then I'll make us a cup of coffee. Oh yes. I feel like in the morning when I'm making coffee, some of the fish can smell the scent of coffee and they always hang out with me on this side of the tank because the coffee machines are just right here. The next thing that I am doing while I'm enjoying my coffee, I'm trying to decide on what hotel to stay at because we are planning on doing a universal staycation coming up very soon. I'm really just going to let Adri pick. Didn't you say you wanted to stay at Cabana Bay, Adri? Yeah. With the big pool and lazy river? I wanted to show you. If you scroll all the way to the bottom, look what's already here. Stella Nova and Terra Luna, two new Epic Universe 
Hotels. Oh, Terra Luna has an opening date, February 25th. We're binging Stranger Things 3. I feel like season three was definitely the best yet. Season four was really good as well. About 45 minutes after I finish my cup of coffee, I'm going to make a little snack before breakfast for myself and Adri. I'm going to be using this light and fit Greek vanilla yogurt, only 90 calories, 14 grams of protein, not too bad. And then I'm gonna use some frozen blueberries because we don't have a lot of fresh fruit right now. We need to make a grocery run. So I'm just making do, and then I'm gonna finish it off with a little drizzle of honey. And this is it. This looks very good. Obviously, I wish I had more fresh fruit, but I need to go to the grocery store. I was debating if I wanted to cut up this pineapple, but I really don't feel like it. And now it's time to take all of my vitamins for the day. It's time to eat official breakfast. I have eggs and birthday protein pancakes. And what I mean by protein pancakes, these beauties, 16 grams of protein, can't beat that. And then I have a little bit of orange juice and we're just enjoying breakfast all together. I just filled up my water bottle and this will be completely gone by the time I finish up at the gym. And I try to drink at least two of these, at least one and a half per day. So I'm done eating until between 4 and 5 p.m., which is normally when I get home from the day. Now I will have a protein shake after the gym, but after breakfast, that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, and I like to ask you guys, what are you currently watching on TV or streaming? I've been hearing really good things about Fallout. I did play the game a little bit growing up. I never beat the game, but I did play it, so I am sort of familiar with that series. I think we're going to definitely watch that at some point this week. I also want to watch, I think it's Shogun on Hulu. That looks really good, but what else should I watch? Let me know down below in the comments. It's just about 11.45 in the morning. I think I'm going to go back downstairs and hang out with the girls and finish up season three of Stranger Things because we're about to finish this season. And then I'm going to head to the gym. And then after the gym, I need to stop at Petco because I need to restock on a few things for the fish tank. And then we're going over Bianca's parents' house for dinner. Her dad is going to grill some steak and salmon. I think we're going to enjoy the pool and we'll see what else we get into on this beautiful Sunday afternoon. Oh my goodness, this is the best part right here. <laughs> Meanwhile, everybody can hear this. Ooh, Bianca is cutting up this pineapple. I was just talking about that this morning. I'm also gonna freeze this stuff. Yeah. The best way to make a smoothie is with frozen fruit. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> Is there pineapple juice in there? Yeah, there's a lot actually. Ooh. Put that in a smoothie. Mm. I'm gonna do that right now. Ooh, looks like a wreck just happened. Hope everybody is okay. In terms of how I've been feeling lately, feel great. I've been in my spring cut since January the 1st. My abs are coming in. I'm very proud of myself. Not going to lie, it has not been easy. But mentally and physically, I feel great. I really feel so good. And, you know, going to the gym has really helped me mentally. It's helped me overcome a lot that I was going through in my life. And, you know, I bring up mentally because doing YouTube drains you mentally to the point where in order for me to continue doing this YouTube thing, I have to take some breaks in between. And I've been taking a huge step away from the Disney side of my job. And I think I'm almost to the point where I feel good. I feel like I can go back and make some Disney content little by little, not going to go super hard, but Disney does have some new things coming up in the summer so I think that's when I'll probably be making my return we have a huge vacation coming up that I'm just literally counting down the days we're so close and if you are here for the cruise content get ready because we have something coming take your mental health serious listen to your body if you feel like you need to take a break if you need a day off do it but yeah we have a lot of really exciting things coming up this year 
everything is finally coming together all of the missing puzzle pieces are now coming together and it's just really exciting i just can't wait to see what our future is going to be like and we have a lot of just really exciting content that's coming up later this year that i can't wait to share with you guys and i do have to apologize a little bit because you know this year i have had to take a few breaks just because of you know again going back to my mental and physical health but also just life i've had a lot of stuff happen this year i've had to just take time away to do some other work get some other businesses going and just you know take care of business and that's exactly what i have done and now that i'm all caught up and everything is playing out the schedule is going back to how it was and yeah I'm just really happy as i'm pulling into the gym and there's no parking i don't really like coming to this gym anymore because of the parking situation as i just found one it's a little further away but not too bad and i guess i'll just end with this i really appreciate each and every one of you for watching these videos or if you're here just because you enjoy hearing my opinions and thoughts just really appreciate you being here because without you guys i really don't think my life would be where it is right now and i have to give a lot of credit to bianca as well i'm gonna go inside kill my chest workout and then head over to petco maybe the fish store i have a few errands and then go back home and see what else we can get into Okay, I just got done working out. I did chest and abs today. And then once I get done in here, I'm going to do probably 20 minutes worth of cardio, possibly on the Stairmaster. I feel like the Stairmaster has been giving me the most results. I mean, look at that. It's a little dark in here, but I have never been this snatched in the waist. I've also never been this full and buff as I am now. I mean, even my legs, let me get closer. I mean, I work hard on my legs. I just cannot believe it. I have a doctor's appointment tomorrow, so I am very eager to see what my actual body fat percentage is right now. I just remembered that I'm all out of black ink for our printer at home, so I'm inside of Office Depot to pick some up and then I'm off to Petco. I found what I was looking for. Inside of Petco now, I need these two bottles. Let's see, I need one of these for the filter. I'm just getting prepared because we have a long cruise coming up. So I just wanna make sure I have everything for the fish sitter. And then I need some seaweed for the tanks. And then I need some more frozen fish food. I think on the way home, I'm going to surprise the girls with some Starbucks. There's nobody here. What the heck, this never happens. I got the goods. I grabbed a few croissants. And then Adri loves this caramel ribbon frappuccino. And then I got Bianca just a iced coffee with white almond milk and two pumps of sugar-free vanilla. Made it back home. The girls are enjoying their Starbucks and I'm going to enjoy my protein shake. You know, one thing that I'm just completely over and that is going to the grocery store. I feel like we go like two to three times a week because when you eat cleaner and when you have more fruits and vegetables in your day-to-day -day diet, you just run through food a lot quicker and exactly and i'm just like <laughs> over it because i feel like we just go all of the time and yeah we could have groceries delivered to the house but when you do like instacart the person doesn't really pick out the best produce like fruits and vegetables they just grab the first available and yeah. you know we, we like our fruits and vegetables how we like it <laughs> it is now four o'clock i have ground chicken and this is made with teriyaki sauce and then we have some steamed broccoli 
I'm drinking a Gatorade and some more water. We made it to Bianca's parents' house and I am in love with their backyard. Look how beautiful. We come here all of the time to enjoy their pool and to enjoy the sun. There's the man, the myth, the legend. Bianca's dad right here. <laughs> I was just telling them about your pool, man. A saltwater pool? Yeah. I did want to do P-Rock, but the baby said it hurt her feet. Uh oh, when she I remember that, neighbors. yeah. But eventually, when she gets a little older, I will drain it and do P-Rock. Okay, all right. You know, uh, it's got a saltwater cell, which is right behind you. It's right here. Oh, look at this. This is the saltwater cell. Okay. Uh, you never need no chlorine. You don't never add no chlorine, and as you can see how clean it is. Yeah. It's nice. Yeah. We have been really liking these Ocean Spray Vodka and Cranberries. They're very light, not heavy at all. These are perfect to drink poolside or if you're on Coco Cay or Castaway Key. Yeah, get these. We're cooking up some fillets. We've got some salmon fillets, Ooh. Brussels sprouts. The grill master. He's here. <laughs> Look how beautiful. All Publix. All Publix. Lean. We got the salmon with the uh, brown sugar. Your girl butters it all. Uh -huh. My daughter, my life. And uh, we hook it up. Every yes, weekend sir. we're going to do this every summer. All right, I'm going to take you up on that. Yeah, some little lemon pepper. We do, uh, my daughter forgot. <laughs> there you go. There you go. He's cream. That's so far there. Oh, Bianca's mom made her famous brownies. And we got the ready whip. I'm gonna enjoy myself. Next. <laughs> we got the ice cream. We're all on a health kick. Mm. As she's cutting brownies. This is a, this is a treat. We made it back home, and now it's time to feed the fish. There you guys go. Yeah. And then before I start to wind down for the night, around this time every single week, I'll come up here in my office and I'll just plan out my week. I'll think of videos that I want to film for the upcoming week. I'll do any research that I need to do. I'll write down notes in my phone so I have them as I'm filming in the parks. And I just prepare myself mentally. I have my agenda for the week. I know what I have to accomplish. And then if I need to take care of anything else personally, I'll do that, like paying bills and just things like that. And then usually I'll just go have my shower and then go downstairs and watch TV or watch Netflix with Bianca before going to bed. I may play a few rounds of gaming before I go off to bed tonight, actually. But yeah, I think that's all that I have to share, at least in this video. I really enjoyed filming this video. I hope you enjoyed watching. It was a lot of fun. Now. I'm not going to film these videos too often like I already mentioned every now and then or just whenever I feel like sharing a chapter of my life with you guys here on the internet. Now if you do like these kind of low-key lifestyle videos, I do have a second channel called Just Dev. I will leave the link to that channel down in the description below if you want to check it out. I also have a Patreon if you want to help support the channel. I do early premieres and different videos on Patreon. We have the wedding stuff coming up, which by the way, I am so excited. October is going to be here before you know it. I'm getting married this year to the love of my life and I'm just so thrilled and can't believe it's happening. We're very close to our new home. That's also very exciting. Also, I did release some brand new t-shirts and hoodies if you're interested. You should see them if you're watching on your phone or on a laptop. You should see them on your screen if you're watching on a TV. I'll have the links down in the description below as well. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and call it a night. I do have a long week ahead, but be expecting some fun videos this week as there's a lot going on. Also, we're getting ready for our big summer cruise, which I am literally counting down the days. I cannot wait for a vacation and I can't wait to bring you guys a brand new cruise series. If there's any specific videos that you guys would like to see from me, go ahead and let me know in the comments down below and I will try my best to get those done. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, please go ahead and give it a big thumbs up as it really does help out the channel in so many different ways. I love you guys so much. Please remember, it's nice to be nice on YouTube.
I'll see you in the next video. Have a great week. I'm out. Woo!